Hi guys, my name is Rubino. I'm back again. I'm here to educate you guys on how to uninstall some stubborn apps from your MacBook. If you're using a MacBook Pro and you have some apps on your MacBook, you've tried all your possible best just to make sure you delete those apps and they're not going out of your MacBook. There is another way you can uninstall those um, apps, stubborn apps from your MacBook. For instance, I'm going to show you um, a simple way how you can delete those stubborn apps from your MacBook. Um, this is my MacBook. Um, for instance, this is um, this. I'm going to delete this app. For instance, now I have it here. Look at my apps. This is my apps. I have it here. This is it. Is it so if I want to delete this app right now? Okay, let me show you something. I'll come back to this place. Um, I'll move it. I'll I'll delete it. It's no more here right now. Then I have to come down to my apps to see if the app is still there. You can see on this place the app is still there, right? did not delete it only deleted from the desktop but right now it's still inside the macbook uh, app side so normal way to uninstall app you have to click on it then it break this sign you click on it for instance let me give you an example you click on it it said delete right but look at this i cannot delete this because it's not showing any sign of delete so these are the kind of stubborn app i'm talking about so the way you can uninstall this kind of app is easy um another type of example is that you can drag your app i'm um, sorry you see um, um you can drag your app you can drag your app like this from the top that's down to the trash it's supposed to delete but no it's very stubborn it still come back to the place you can drag it you can drag it like this down to the trash it's still come back again this is not the normal this is not the proper way to delete this kind of stubborn app the easiest way to delete this kind of stubborn app you have to come up here come to the top you see where it says go click on the go then you scroll down to the applications you click on the applications then all you see is all your apps on your macbook look at look at i got okay for instance i'm going to delete this parallel desktop so even if i have to drag it down to the trash again notice notice going to work it's still going to be there even if i have to keep dragging it down to the trash or even if I have to keep dragging it down to the trash, it's not gonna work. Trash is not gonna work. Look at what it says. This item, okay. So we have to go to the desktop and close this item. Then we'll come back to this same place. Okay, let's go back to the desktop. Okay. I have to move this again to the trash and here. Then come back here, quit this app. The app is quit right now. So let's go back to the apps again. Okay, it's still there on my apps, on my application. So we have to delete this right now. The easiest way is to delete this app. You have to do it again, bring it down to the trash. Oh, this app is really stubborn. So you see. Keep dragging it down and they keep doing stubbornness. Okay, let's go back to the go here. Yeah, come to your applications. Now we are the applications. Then look at it. You have to drag it down here. If they say they are stubborn, we are more stubborn than them. Okay. Now it's gonna tell you to put your password. By you using your password, it means you are approving this app from deleting. Then you are going back to your normal uh, to your normal uh, MacBook. Page 
so right now we have to click on it mine is just instead of using the password i just use my 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 thumb like um i have to touch it then the app is gone it's gone so it's just like magic and this this i can i can also delete this app by like screwing down um moving this this to the trash it's easy this item toothbrush cannot be deleted okay let me try again um okay this item parallel tools cannot be moved to the trash because it's open okay let's say the app is open so we have to go down to this place look at the app see how it's open then we close it okay always make sure whatever you have on your trash you delete it you delete it permanently so that you can your, your space can still be like just click on empty empty the trash so those stuff are no more there so let me see how this is open okay okay i guess i guess different kinds of stubborn apps that you have on your mind book that you don't really know how to go about them you understand let's use the same method uh oh because it's open the same thing mm. okay move okay we have to look at how this is open we have to see if it's really open then we can close it then we can have a successful deleting of this app so let's go back right now click on it mm -hmm. okay this is the app quit So open your trash now you're going to find the avocado you see empty so guys thank you for watching this is how you can successfully delete any kind of stubborn apps from your macbook pro thank you so much thanks for watching yeah